Hello and welcome to Flowing with Angels. Thank you so much for joining me and for all of your love and support for this channel. I hope you are doing well. This week we continue with a message from the Guardian Angel Collective featuring the symbolism of the waterfall. Now if you would like to be introduced to your personal Guardian Angel, please be sure to check out my Guardian Angel readings that I offer through my website flowingwithangels.com. Let's explore the spiritual meaning of the waterfall first before we move on to the channeled message. Waterfalls are beautiful majestic features of nature found deep in the forests and hills away from the busy, chaotic and polluted urban areas. They represent calmness, purity and serenity. The constant rush of the falling water creates a soothing yet penetrating sound that clears our minds and brings us back to the present moment. The cleansing and purifying qualities of the flowing water encourage us to let go of what no longer serves us release old pain and disappointments, and move on with renewed clarity and hope. A waterfall is also a symbol of the continuous flow of life, the abundant flow of divine wisdom and guidance, and the unwavering presence and support of the universe in which we exist. Our lives have different paths and rhythms to them, and when we tune into our natural passions, inherent gifts and the wisdom of our intuition, we allow ourselves to have an easier, more joyful journey. A waterfall serves as a gentle reminder to relinquish control, embrace change and surrender to the ongoing process of our spiritual growth and development. Let's see how the beautiful guardian angel Mimosa, who represents all of your guardian angels, integrates the energy of the waterfall into his guidance for us. Dear people, once again it is a joy for me, Mimosa, to convey my message to you on behalf of all of your guardian angels. They wish you to know that you are greatly loved, supported and guided at all times. Today I would like to inspire you with the symbolism of the waterfall and how you can apply its spiritual meaning into your life. When you have lived on this planet for several years, you have collected a lot of mental, emotional and material possessions that you have stored in your mind, body, energy field and physical environment. However, the majority of this collection weighs you down rather than lifts you up. And that is why it is time to lighten your load. Once in a while, a big clear out and overhaul of your life circumstances is necessary to keep the energy flowing and allow new inspiration and beginnings to enter. When you cannot see the forest for the trees anymore, allow me to guide you to a beautiful metaphorical waterfall in the middle of this forest of muddled perceptions and unclear thinking. Once you start to feel overwhelmed by the load that you are carrying, you will either tend to distract yourself from the chaos, or you will find yourself drowning in feelings of depletion and tiredness, lacking the motivation to move forward. The energy of the waterfall will not only help you to clear the clutter, but it will also revitalize you and recharge you with fresh new energy and ideas if you are open to it. So let's take a look at how and why you distract yourself from your own inner turmoil by focusing on other people's affairs and the challenges they face. Ironically, you recognize the need and desire for peace and harmony in their lives but you forget to tend to your own well-being first. You preoccupy yourself by either trying to actively help them or silently or openly discussing their affairs in detail, both of which are like carrying water to the sea when your energy frequency is not held high and you have not yet found stability and harmony within yourself. Your actions will not match your vibration 
And instead of inspiring and empowering others with your radiant light and energy, your motives are muddled with a false sense of worthiness and importance. The acts of offering help and generously sharing your time, means and effort are in and of themselves beautiful qualities, but they are only meaningful when they come from a full, balanced and peaceful heart, without a sense of urgency and need to rescue the world and the people around you. Practice holding the vision of love, light and perfect health and well-being for them instead, and only join them in their activities with an empowering spirit of upliftment and praise. Distractions can also come in the form of a lack of priorities in your own life. You lose time and precious energy micromanaging a life filled with trivial objects and affairs. The key to getting clarity on what is truly important to you is to simplify your life and adapt a simple structure and schedule that allows time for reflection and withdrawal of thought, but also for enjoyment and fun. Do not become a slave of merely your current tangible earthly existence, but leave room for the flow of spiritual energy. Make sure you are able to act on new inspiration and ideas by allowing space for them to enter into your life. Does your life feel like a boarded up house or like one with bright open windows and doors that feels light and airy with lots of room for redecoration and refurbishment? Are you clinging to objects and energies that are not even your own or are not taken in by your own choice? This is a call for discernment, dear people. Get your brooms out and symbolically start sweeping your houses, or better yet, visualize a giant waterfall cleaning everything out that is no longer needed. And then we come to the other side of the coin, where you are not busy running around or involved in too many affairs, most of them not even your own, but you are paralyzed by an overwhelming sense of depletion and tiredness. This is a consequence of you trying to manage your patterns of distractions that are mentally and physically exhausting, as well as of your limiting belief systems that prevent you from exploring your talents and natural gifts and interests in an easy and joyful way. First and foremost, make sure you get enough rest to recuperate your physical body, but also be willing to take an honest inventory of your life. One of the biggest energy drainers is self-doubt, which I would like to expand a little bit further on. Self-doubt creeps up when you cease to recognize your own beauty and celebrate your own uniqueness. You slowly lose touch with your higher self and inner guidance and start to look to others for guidance and reassurance. However, nobody but you can determine the right course of action for you dear ones, because you have come to earth for your own desired experiences and expansion. Nobody can truly adapt your point of view and perception, and especially your energy frequency at any given moment. That is why I encourage you to start listening to your own heart and stop questioning the guidance that it so lovingly conjures up for you. The outcome of your choices and actions might not suit everyone, but it will certainly enrich your life as it adds to the fullness of your soul incarnated in a human body. Take charge of your life and assume responsibility for your state of independence and empowerment. Other people will only be able to speak from their own viewpoint and according to their own energy vibration and their influence and wisdom can be a wonderful addition and inspiration to your outlook on life, but not to the point that you start questioning your own ability to choose and direct your life. Self-doubt is cultivated by your social conditioning and environment, but you have the choice to let it paralyze you or let its influence be washed away by the flow of the mighty cleansing metaphorical waterfall we, your guardian angels, 
are here to keep you securely grounded in your own energy field and we make sure to inspire you to follow your own unique path. Feel free to ask us for our help and guidance because we are the ones who truly know the content of your hearts. Be blessed, dear ones. Thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bell to never miss a new video. I wish you a wonderful week. Until next time, namaste.